Good morning, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another media. And today we are at her favorite place. What can it be? And we got a cabana for We're the so first excited. time ever because we've never gotten a cabana when we come to Volcano Bay. So we got a group of friends we all got together and we we're like you know what let's just pitch in for a, a cabana and see if it's worth it and so we're here finally i think we've been counting down the days for this vacation I for a very very long time because we booked this like two months ago maybe yeah it was it's been a while it's been a while it's been a while so we got our coffee Stop already me. uh we're feeling pretty good so we're gonna head on into the park finally made it the day is perfect there's like no clouds in the sky it's hot the volcano is looking amazing all right so i think we're gonna go find some chairs and wait for the rest of our friends to come so that we can go ahead and get the cabana so i think we should find some chairs around here enjoy the wave pool for now wow there are a lot of chairs available today look at this i think it just opened what time did it open it opened at 10 in the morning what time is it you know that's not a thought. <laughs> Ash went like this to check the time, but the Tapu Tapu doesn't tell you the time, unfortunately. All right, we put our bag there. And now we're headed inside to the wave pool. Woo, it is so hot today. It feels nice though, right? It does. Oh, I wonder if the water is... Oh, it is freezing. Oh my goodness. The water is super cold. Wow, it is colder than the beach. I know. Hey, I hope the, the Lazy River is not as cold like this. Normally it's hotter. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it is freezing. Guys, the water looks so crystal clear. It looks so beautiful. Oh my goodness. It feels so good to be here. We've been waiting since like months to come back. Oh yeah, is that new? Or maybe we're just trying to get to the other side. I don't know, but I've oh, never yeah. seen them from this way. Right, so we were able to go a little bit more in. But not fully in, because it's still a little cold. But you said you're getting used to it. Little by little, like as you walk a little bit, and a little yeah. bit, you start getting used to it. So that's where, it's, that's where I'm at right now. I don't, I don't know about me. <laughs> they go out from there. All right, guys, I went in. She still d doesn't want to go all the way inside. I, I told her to go, but I told her to, like, go down. No, no. Not yet. I'm not ready yet. Uh-oh, the waves are about to start. It's a warning. Oh. The water is freezing, honestly. Woo. And now we're headed over to get the cabana, and hopefully we get one in a nice area. Just in case you forget your sunscreen like we did, they got you covered. Now over here by the Wave Village East, these are the lockers that we recommend because it's away from everybody. So they're easy to access. So as soon as you come inside, the cabana check-in is gonna be straight to your left. Mind you, the volcano is right there. So straight to your left. All right, so now they are taking us straight to our cabana. So let's check it out and see where it's located. These are pretty nice. All right. Well, I guess we're going upstairs yeah. now. Oh. Walking. It's gonna have all the rides on here. Now let's check out Crackett 
Oh, wow. I don't believe that. <laughs> I don't believe that either. <laughs> so they also have the tablet here where you can pretty much get whichever ride that you want, depending on the wait time. So it'll tell you here, Kala and Tainui is 10 minutes. So all you would do is just tap your Tapu Tapu onto this and you're already in line instead of walking and finding the ride. You also get a refrigerator here with some waters look at that some ice in here it keeps it nice and cool and then what do you have in here oh you have a safe just in case you need it you got some towels here which is good all right so you also get your own menus here and you could just text this number and they'll be able to bring you your uh, your food did they say to order everything at once or yeah no i mean you can keep ordering as you count but be considerate like hey compile your order and stuff like that as don't just go. order one thing five yeah, minutes like, order hey, another one and when she comes back <laughs> hey can i get this too and when she comes back again yo let me get some i'm like yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh look the white watermelon is in the menu so that's what we drink here you also have a map of the park in case you're trying to find something for example if you're trying to find a specific restaurant or a ride or anything you don't know where it is you got the map this is also a pretty nice view guys look at that pretty nice view all right what do we got mike so this is with the cabana you get like a little light snacks and refreshment a little a little muffin action a little pineapple action wow, a little danish some little fruits a little cookies say welcome Ooh. with cano bay that frosting looks good and you get a server not good look as are good you a server as, not as good looking as me but <laughs> maybe something all right guys so we just came back from the lazy river but i did want to let you guys know that we passed by krakatau because we were going to ride that right so we had it on our tapu tapu and apparently they're doing some type of testing so they're doing a standby line which is the first time i've ever heard of it here at volcano bay volcano bay is not known for having standby lines so i guess they're testing it out and see how it works so they are currently doing a standby line for krakatau so you cannot use your tapu tapu and right now the wait time was 60 minutes for that ride we didn't do it well we haven't done it yet don't know if we're going to do it by the end of the day but they are doing testing so that's good to know who knows if they're gonna end up doing standby lines at Volcano Bay and then your Tapu Tapu will be kind of like an express line? I don't know, it's kind of interesting that we saw that. Here are other things that you can do with the Tapu Tapu tablet. You can pick a ride, which we showed you guys. Then you can view the food menu. So you can click here and then it'll take you here you can scroll and see exactly the different type of food that they have available for like these are appetizers they got sandwiches they got a burger a cohola burger they have some entrees here they have the longboard pizzas which i just ordered the pepperoni one actually I'm waiting for it to get here they got fresh salad fresh salads which is good desserts they have a chocolate lava cake Ooh, that sounds good. Oh, they have a brookie. I wonder if that's a cookie or like an actual brownie. And you can view the drink menu. And you just wait for it to come up. And you just scroll. There it is. The Balls Fire Punch. Toasted Coconut Pineapple. The Tiki Punch. We've only tried the White Watermelon. I haven't tried this Tiki Punch yet. They have the Haku Puini. The Kokiri Plunge. I don't even know if it's pronouncing that correctly we have the volcano bay rum punch blue hawaiian and the y watermelon which is the one that we usually get and you can view the map which is pretty cool so if you want to know where a ride is i guess you could tap in here and it tells you how to get there let's see oh no maybe you could scroll oh okay so these are different types of attractions these are the food venues it'd be nice if it told you like how to get there though doesn't these are the merchandise restrooms lockers guest services that's pretty cool so kind of is worth it just to get the, the the cabana all right here i got the longboard pepperoni pizza so i can't wait to try it i'm sure it's gonna be good all right guys so fast tracking to the house to plantation so we are back home after uh a day at volcano bay um, and I can honestly tell you that 
the cabana was definitely worth it for the price and everything that has included um if you're going to volcano bay with your whole entire family with a large group um i think it's worth it with everything that's included with all like the food like like the fruits and the snacks and you know it's included towels you have a refrigerator with water you do have that tapu tapu tablet where you can actually hop into any line of any part of any of the rides sorry um, and you don't have to physically be there to get a wait time. You can do it from the cabana as well. So I think it's really worth it as well because of that feature, honestly, because of those certain options that it provides. I think that is worth it, especially if you're going with a large group, like I said. If it's just two people, maybe it's not worth it. Maybe you want to look into the premium seating better if it is just two people. If it's a large group of six or more, I highly suggest looking into the, the cabanas because we definitely enjoyed it. We had a great time. The customer service was great. We had our own uh, bartender and our own waiter as well. The tip you included after everything, so at the end, so you don't have to worry about tipping every time they come. You can just tip at the end once your day is over. But if you guys are going to Volcano Bay, please go ahead and make sure that you check out the, the Cabana Bay options because if you are, like I said, a large group, you're definitely going to thank me. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If this was your first time watching our channel, welcome to the Mac and Media family. Go ahead and click that like button and also click that subscribe button so that we see you again in our next video. We wish you guys can stay, but now it's time for you guys to go and we will catch you guys on the next media.